how to change buy it now button on Shopify. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. In this video, we're gonna be talking about changing the buy now button on Shopify in the easiest, most simplest way possible. So let's get straight into it. Now to start things off, to change the buy now button on your Shopify, what you're gonna to wanna to do is you're gonna basically First of all, go ahead into your Shopify store, obviously. So to change the appearance or settings of an existing buy button, you need to edit the embedded code that you've added to your source HTML or some type of editing. So basically, uh, you're gonna go into your online store. You're gonna go into, you know, whatever theme you're editing this. You're gonna go into actions, okay? Or you can just simply go into edit code. So let's say this is my um, page. So I'm gonna go into this. Now, once you do that, basically, once you've gone into actions, you're going to go into sections. OK, so choose the sections code over here. OK, and here it should give you main product liquid. OK, so your main product liquid. There we go. And what you're going to do is you're going to find a line that says form payment button. So it's going to be somewhere in this code. Obviously, if it's difficult for you to find, you can simply just go ahead, do control F and you can find just write form. OK, and uh, I'm going to click on next. Uh, you're going to find form dash payment method. OK, or payment button. Now, if it takes time to find that, you can just write payment underscore method because this is a huge line of code so you are going to want to scurry through this so find the payment method button now in the case that the payment method button is not here what you can simply do is i'm just going to write this whole code that it gives you so we're going to take this i'm going to write it right here and paste it okay and we're going to find this so it's going to give you form uh, dash payment method now in the case that you can't find this line of code you know this line of code in the case it's not appearing for you you can obviously add this line of code by yourself under your main product section and uh, once you've added this line of code you're going to replace it with a certain code that i'm going to paste in right now so we're going to come here and you're simply just going to go ahead i'm going to scroll up here I'm going to come at the end of the script and I am going to be adding this line of code. So you can see button type, button class, Shopify, form, payment, button. We're going to add that. We're going to click on save. And once you click on save, it's going to basically save that code. And that is going to be a different type of customized by button code. So basically, you're going to need to mess around with code when you're messing around with a different buy button. So let me show you what the vibe of it might look like now. So let's say I'm going to go and shop all the products. And if you have any products, I'm going to come to my cart over here. Now, as you can see, the buy button is a bit customized and uh, you can obviously see it's going to give you an add to cart or custom text that you can add for yourself differently. So, yeah, just use code and it should be pretty easy to change your buy button. So that's about it. Thank you for watching and I'll see all of you next time. Goodbye.